got our normal, you know, Gen 3 HD display here. I'm going to update this. Okay, plug the USB disk drive, click OK. Actually, select the file. It does help. So, this is a hot off the press that I got from an email to test out, and we'll see how it looks. I haven't played with this at all yet, so we'll see what it looks like. Quite a uh, bit of files to update. Alright, well that already looks a lot different. So let's see... This one's a kill shot too. I don't want it on the wizard. Look at that. That's kind of neat. I wonder. A little Aces card there. Oh, they got some presets here. Uh, let's go to that one. So this has your speedometer down the bottom there, it looks like. And your RPM. And then, yeah, okay, so that's just a flat out speedometer. Oh, and then you can swipe over to different gauges. I was just testing that, I didn't know it actually worked. That's pretty cool. I wonder is there a way? Okay, so if you're on. One of these, and you hit this little ace on the side, it brings you right back to your home screen. Now, can I? Ooh, what's that one do? So you can change colors that way. Let's uh, go back to this one and change colors. Uh, it doesn't have it up there. There's got to be a way. But the blue goes with blue. So that works out fine for me. Also, check this out. Those things are pretty sweet. Okay, back to this. So, monitor. Do. Like I said, I haven't messed with this at all yet either. So, I'm not entirely sure what all you can do on them either. But I feel like there should be a way to change what color we're looking at here. Maybe that's in a future thing because this is just a test version that I got sent. Looks pretty much the same, just different colors and things. Ooh, I do want to check that. Logging. Can I first? We're gonna select all. Look at there. Sample frequency is already maxed out. Start log. Now, can I? <gasps> I can. You can back out. 
and it's still logging by the indicator up there. This is awesome because up until now the only way to do that is either with the laptop or the Bluetooth. So that is new for these. Um, let's see. What's this one look like? Oh, so you can change the background. Can I? I wonder how I load my own in there. I'll figure that out. Isn't that pretty? You got a big mountain. Oops. Okay. So change the color of the gauges. Kind of it's hard to see on them. What color you pick? But it looks cool in the background. I bet this one's gonna be kind of the same. Yeah, it's super neat looking. Just kind of hard to read. Um, what else do we got here? So maybe there's a little color thing I missed on this one. Oh, look at that! A little help thingy. Neat. I just want to change color. Now this is super cool. Big improvement. And the fact that I'm still logging is awesome. Stop log and it brings up a save thing instead of just that default uh, numbers that you can get. So I'll just do test one and that saved and then USB disk I can just I already still have mine stabbed in there and you can copy it right to it so also on that note this USB disk is the one I always recommend to people it's made by these guys but honestly it doesn't really matter the brand these ones are just cheap and easy, but it's got the USB-C and the USB-A, so you don't need the adapter. They work great. I use them all the time. Every now and then they do crap out. It's like 16 bucks for a pair of two, so yeah, just get these. They work great. Anyways, back to this, see if I find anything else new. Anything new on here? I'll we'll play with those, are all the same as far as I can tell. Oh, that's something different. I think this is in the new, um, I think this is in the software for the kill shot, too, as well. But yeah, dual quad basic fuel adapt. Well, what that means, I don't know yet. But it says dual quad, so it has to be good. Scroll up. Yeah, there's the rest of it's basically the same. Um, but this is awesome, and being able to log is also awesome. Sure, there's a way for me to actually customize what gauges are where somewhere along the line. I'll figure that out. Make another we'll make another actual video that um goes over this stuff. This is just kind of a first glance. So all right, that's first glance of the new GUD for the HD handhelds. And there's a car.